the cost of shallots or red onions has caught up and even surpassed the price of pork a kilo. Even worse, relief lies a long way ahead as prices of all onions threaten to surge, as our Kenneth Pashenta lays out in this report. Paliseo used to buy kilos of red onions for his Paris business. Now, he's only using onion leaves. Bumibili na lang tayo ng sibuyas dahon kasi yun po yung kaya. Sa halagang 800 na dahon, ngayon sa maghapon na po yun, hinahaluan na lang po ng bunga ganyan. This is his strategy now that the price of red onions in the markets is at 280 pesos to 300 pesos per kilo due to low supply. So the Agriculture Department is now closely coordinating with the Bureau of Plant Industry or BPI to control the price of red onions. DA is waiting for the BPI report. Para makita po natin ang supply situation para malaman natin kung anong kadahilanan ng pag-spike ng presyo. BPI is now making rounds in cold storage facilities where red onions being sold in the markets came from after being harvested months ago. Ema is now thinking how to recover her investment. 10 kilo binili ko kagabi. 2,000 na mahigit, magta 3,000 na eh. Magkano lang naman binta araw-araw? Di ba? Paano mo i-divide yun? Buyers are also affected. Pero siyempre, kailangan nyo sa pagluto. Wala kang magawa kung hindi bumili. Kahit sa konti-konti nila. Despite of the spike in prices, the DA is not seeing the need to import red onions, especially since onion farmers are set to harvest their crops next month. Tinitingnan natin kung gaano kalaki ang kanilang volume na i-harvest dahil ito po ay makakatulong sa pagdagdag ng ating supply. At alam naman po natin na pag nadagdagan ng ating supply, yan din po ay makakatulong sa pagbaba ng presyo. Meanwhile, the agency assured the public that they can buy cheaper red onions in Kadiwa ng Pasko at 170 pesos per kilo. 28 Kadiwa ng Pasko sites are set to open tomorrow across the country. Kenneth Pasyente for the nation.